Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss present value or present worth of an annuity. Now, the present value or present worth of an annuity is the sum of the present values of its different installments, that is, the total worth of all the payments of annuity under consideration at the beginning of the annuity. It can also be understood as the lump sum is invested at compound interest with the objective of obtaining a series of payments over some future period of time. The lump sum invested is called the present value of an ordinary annuity. Now consider an ordinary annuity of $10,000 per year for 3 years with money worth 4% Now suppose Mr. X takes a loan and repays it in three equal installments of $10,000 per annum then the loan taken is the present worth of the annuity. So we have taken that Mr. X takes a loan and repays it in three equal installments of $10,000 per annum. Now, by using the compound interest formula, that is the amount A is equal to P into 1 plus I whole raised to power N where n is the number of periods, i is equal to r upon 100, where r percent is the rate of interest per period. Now here, the rate of interest per period is given as 4%, that is the rate of interest per year is given as 4%. So here, I will be equal to R upon 100 which is equal to 4 upon 100 which is equal to 0 0.04. Now, using this formula for the compound interest, for the first installment, ten thousand will be equal to P1 into 1 plus i the whole. That is, for the first installment, n is equal to 1 year and let p is equal to p1 and a is equal to $10,000. This implies p1 is equal to 10,000 upon 1 plus i, that is 1 plus 0 0.04, which is equal to 10,000 upon 1.04. Now, for the second installment, that p is equal to p2, so this is equal to 10,000 upon 1 plus i 
one raised to the power 2 as here n is equal to 2 years. So this is equal to 10,000 upon 1.04 whole square. Then for third installment, let P is equal to P3, which is equal to 10,000 upon 1 plus I whole raised to power 3. That is here, N is 3 years. So this is equal to 10,000 upon 1.04 whole raised to power 3. Now we know that the present value or present worth of a given NUD is the sum of the present values of its different installments. So here, let the present value or present worth of the given NUD be B. So P will be equal to P1 plus P2 plus P3. Therefore, P is equal to P1 plus P2 plus P3, which is equal to 10,000 upon 1.04 plus 10,000 upon 1.04 whole square plus 10,000 upon 1.04 whole cube, which is further equal to 10,000 upon 1.04 into 1 plus 1 upon 1.04 plus 1 upon 1.04 whole square and this complete whole. Now, this is a geometric progression with A is equal to 1 and R is equal to 1 upon 1.04 which is less than 1 so when R is less than 1, then in a geometric progression we can find out the sum of two n terms that is Sn by using the formula which is A into 1 minus R raised to power n the whole whole upon 1 minus R. So this is equal to 10,000 upon 1.04 into now A is 1. So this will be 1 minus R raised to power n, that is 1 upon 1.04 whole raised to power 3, as n here is 3, whole upon 1 minus R, that is 1 minus 1 upon 1.04, the whole, and this complete whole, now this is equal to 10,000 upon 1.04 into 1 minus 1 upon, now 1.04 whole cube is 1.124864. Then upon, find the denominator, it will be 1.04 minus 1 whole upon 1.04 and this complete whole. Now this is equal to 10,000 upon 1.04 into 1 minus 0 0.888996 the whole into 1.04 upon 0 0.04. Further, on solving this is equal to 10,000 into 0 0.111004 into 100 whole upon 4 which is equal to 27,751 dollars. Now we should know one important result that is the present value of an NUT is equal to amount into 1 plus i whole raised to power minus n. Now for the present value of an NUT, let us discuss 
person case one, that is to find the present value of an NUT immediate. Now, in the case of NUT immediate, the present value P will be equal to A upon 1 plus I plus A upon 1 plus I whole square plus so on up to plus A upon 1 plus I whole raised to power N which is equal to A upon 1 plus I whole raised to power N into 1 plus i whole raised to power n minus 1 plus 1 plus i whole raised to power n minus 2 plus so on up to plus 1. This complete whole further this can be written as a upon 1 plus i whole raised to power n into 1 plus 1 plus i the whole plus 1 plus i whole square plus so on up to plus 1 plus i whole raised to power n minus 1 and this complete whole. Now this is the geometric progression where the r is equal to 1 plus i and a is 1. So here r is 1 plus i the whole that means r is greater than 1 and when r is greater than 1 then in a geometric progression we can find out the sum of two n terms by using the formula that is Sn is equal to A into R raised to power n minus 1 the whole whole upon R minus 1. So this is equal to A upon 1 plus I whole raised to power n into 1 plus i whole raised to power n minus 1 whole upon 1 plus i the whole minus 1 and this complete whole. Now this is equal to a upon i into 1 minus 1 upon 1 plus i whole raised to power n and this complete whole which is equal to a upon i into 1 minus 1 plus i whole raised to power minus n and this complete whole. So this is the present value which is denoted by capital P in case of annuity immediate. Now let us discuss the case 2 and that is to find the present value of an NUT due. Now, in the case of NUT due, we have capital A that is the future amount of the NUT is equal to A into 1 plus I the whole whole upon i into 1 plus i whole raised to power n minus 1 and this complete whole where a is the annual payment of each installment of an annuity of n periods. Now using this formula we can find out the present value of an annuity so the present value of an NET that is P is equal to amount that is A into 1 plus I the whole whole upon I into 1 plus I whole raised to power N minus 1 and this complete whole into 1 plus I whole raised to power minus N. Further this is equal to a upon i into 1 plus i the whole into now 1 plus i whole raised to power n into 1 plus i whole raised to power minus n will be equal to 1 plus i whole raised to power n minus n which is equal to 
1 plus i whole raised to power 0 minus 1 into 1 plus i whole raised to power minus n will be 1 plus i whole raised to power minus n and this completes whole. So this is equal to a upon i into 1 plus i the whole into now 1 plus i whole raised to power 0 will be 1 minus 1 plus i whole raised to power minus n and this complete whole. So this is the present value p of an NUT tune. So in this session you have learnt about present value or present worth of an NUT and this completes our session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.